first outing since September here on Windsor and Compton. Just thought I'd uh, have a go at practicing uh, distance feeder fishing. I'm only fishing about 45 meters, I think. My first skimmer of the day. Marie's almost bream. Nice fish to start the day on. <coughs> I'm just fishing with hair with corn. Mix I'm using is uh, Bremo Black with uh, can't beat a bit of caramel. I love using that stuff in uh, for colder months. Six degrees here now. So we're kind of getting into the colder months. I haven't been out for a while because uh, I either keep injuring myself or uh, there's been some uh, deaths in the family and whatnot. Back out on the bank again now, that's all that counts. Also, using my new reel, which is the, uh, the ends on Daiwa 5000. My uh, 4,000 reels were a bit too uh, undergun for this kind of thing. After my last outing when I was down at uh, Martello Lakes. I had to uh, up my game a little bit. second skimmer I think. Just seems to be swimming towards me at the moment. Corn's still on. I'll change it anyway, it was all full of snot. Lovely way of fishing. Didn't have to wait that long for the bite either, it was only about three minutes. <laughs> I've got a it's about 40 centimetre hook length on there. Just a, obviously a free running rig, a couple of 
float stops there, bit of twizzled line, then loop to loop to look. Pretty simple really. Got like a medium um, <coughs> feeder link on there. Could actually change that to a short one, but it's working okay so far. Too bad today, I thought it was going to be a bit stronger than this, but so far it's alright. Two skimmers and three chucks, not bad. I've got some worms and dead maggots here as well, but seem to be doing alright on corn. Well, a lot of small roach in it, I don't really want to be catching tiny little roach on maggots or bits of worm. I went a bit quiet for about <clears throat> went a bit quiet for about half an hour. So I swapped over to hair rig worm. Second cast. And I got one. Feels like another skimmer. All I've done is just dip the head off the worm and then just threaded it through. Let's get the slime off there. Still having a bit of corn every now and again just to keep them interested in it. I just swapped over to a window feeder just to see if it makes any difference. I was, I was getting bites quite quick. I was putting quite a lot of worm in. So I decided to uh, take normal feeder off, stick a window on, just pile some bait in, and they're going nuts. So there's me thinking, you know, they're on a, a wind down, no, they're still having it. It's only a small one. Just kind of like half filling the window feeder with worm, a couple of dead maggots, a bit of corn, just capping it off with the ground bait. I make this kind of dry ish, I haven't over wetted it or anything. Also, shorten my hook length down a bit. You know, I noticed they were attacking the feeder quite a lot. Made a few little adjustments. I don't mind catching small skimmers. Like I said, I'm only out here practicing anyway, just to get my mind back into uh, doing this style of fishing. I haven't done 
any considerable amount of feeder fishing or proper feeder fishing that doesn't involve a, a method feeder or anything for ages I used to do it in Germany quite a lot fishing distances are about like 60 or 70 meters it's just nice to do something different for a change Sure, what this is. Pretty sure it's not a brain. <laughs> I think what I was targeting today, but... Quick. There he is. Like I said, not exactly target species today, but nice fish to end the day on. Catch you later.